Hi, Earth Signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to find out how does your person in mind feel about you right now. And this is a love reading, so your person in mind has to be involved romantically with you in some way, shape, or form. Sorry for my voice, Earth Signs. Let's get a reading started. Spirits and Angels, please show me for Earth Signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn, their person in mind. How do they feel about Earth Signs right now? Eight of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Okay, I'm going to start with if this is someone new, someone relatively new you could be currently connected with, and then um, someone you're separated from, okay? So, our signs, five of Pentacles, the Tower, and then we've got the Hierophant. If this is someone new, I feel like currently they may be realizing that this connection may not be easy. There could be some obstacles. But the Hierophant here indicates even though there are some obstacles, they're willing to have faith. They're willing to do the right thing to make it happen. Okay, Some of you, these obstacles could be because of distance or it could be anything. It could be money, distance, mm, maybe related to family situation okay or a marriage it could be anything but i feel like there are some obstacles if there's someone new it's definitely not easy but they're realizing it that um they realize that there will be obstacles or currently both of you could be facing some obstacles but they're willing to do the right thing and see it through with you okay we've got the ace of wands here ten of wands in reverse and we've got the ten of swords I feel like Earth Signs, if this is someone new, Ace of Wands, they feel like this connection could grow. It could grow into something. Mm, and they are very passionate about you. And they're very turned on by you, for sure. Okay, And Ten of Wands in reverse. Yeah, it feels like because the attraction is so strong that they don't mind carrying these burdens. Not, they don't mind carrying certain responsibilities in regards to this connection. And the number 10 indicates an ending as well. It feels like they maybe, if there's someone new, they feel like it is worth it to carry these burdens because for some reason, you help them get through something. Okay, it could be trauma from the past, it could be excess, forgetting about their excess because of you. You are a good distraction for them, but also at the same time, they feel like you're worth it, okay? Because Hierophant is someone good, someone who goes by the book. So for a lot of you earth signs, maybe you, you've been saying the right thing, doing the right thing. So it gives them more hope and faith. And how do you say this word? Mm. They have a stronger conviction in regards to what they truly believe that this connection can work despite any hurdles or, or obstacles. Okay? If this is someone new. Seven of Cups here is in my first and we've got the world in my first and the king of cups this person could be a water sign pisces cancer or a scorpio can be any sign virgo taurus capricorn i'm seeing fire here aries sagittarius leo any fixed signs okay 
I do sense that your person in mind, if there's someone relatively new, they're falling in love with you or that they are catching feelings, okay? The world in reverse indicates them wanting to stick around. Perhaps both of you have already started uh, some new chapters. A new chapter it could be very, very new in the beginning, okay? And they're trying to, you know, because they're around the snake here eating its, its, how do you say, its own tail. So they're willing to eat their own tail. <laughs> That means there could be some sacrifice or that just them enduring certain difficulties, willing to endure certain difficulties to be with you, to make this happen. Seven of Cups here is in reverse. There's no doubt you are the best option, best choice for them. Nobody compares to you, okay? Hence, they're willing to work hard on this connection with Eight of Pentacles here. They may also feel like you're somebody who works really hard. And you are respectable or that you have a good reputation about you. Um, that they feel like they can trust you. Because the Hierophant, you know, it's a student-teacher's dynamic. So usually the students listen to the teacher because they trust the teachers. Um, they trust the teacher, number one. Number two, they trust that the teacher could help them learn more some of you you may be helping this person learning more about themselves you may have said certain things that may have made them realize certain things right with the tower here so that to me is refreshing and ace aces you know means something new so you have they feel like you have made them feel brand new or that you have made them feel inspired made them realize certain things in life or made them realize that love is real and that a good person that seems too good to be true is real okay if this is someone relatively new <laughs> okay and for those of you if your person in mind is somebody you separated from, because there are cards here, of course, that could indicate separation. The Tower, the Ten of Swords, and then the Ten of Cups here in reverse. Your person whom you separated from, they miss you. Five Pentacles um, and the Hierophant. Maybe they feel they're realizing that you've taught them a lesson. Or this connection, the, the ending of this connection has taught this person a lesson. They may also feel like you've started a new connection somewhere. Ace of Wands here. Or that they may still be interested in you, interested in reigniting passion with you. For those of you earth signs, if you've, you're already seeing someone new, Ace of Wands here, um, they may feel like Ten of Wands and most. Maybe I should just give up. Maybe I should just give up on earth signs and don't pursue it or don't try and have any more hope that we could reconcile. And we've got the Ten of Swords here. They feel devastated, in pain, in a lot of pain. They feel like maybe this has ended. Um, Seven of Cups in reverse, the world in reverse. That means your person in separation right now, they may feel like they can't move on, right? They're realizing that maybe with the King of Cups here, that... Their love for you is too deep, too strong. Not they find it really hard to move on from you, okay? And the King of Cups is also somebody very... Somebody who suppresses their feelings, right? They may be doing the best that they can to suppress their feelings for you. Mm -hmm. And the fact that they can't quite move on completely from you yet. Okay. Eight of Pentacles. They may be feeling like they need to work harder on themselves. Or that they need to make more money. We've got the Ace of Swords here in what first Will of Fortune in reverse another stuck energy. So if you're separated from this person, they find it really hard to move on and ace of swords and reverse they find it really hard to cut you off cut you out of their mind so eight of pentacles can indicate them focusing on their work doing the best that they can to ignore their thoughts of you their feelings for you 
and four wands in reverse. They feel like both of you are separated. There's instability between you and this person. Okay, if both of you are separated right now. However, if this is someone new, relatively new, they're unclear how things are gonna pan out between between the two of you. Mm. But I feel like they're willing to... It's almost like Eight of Pentacles, you know, focusing on details. Like, one step at a time. Right? Because this person is actually carving out the details on this... On these pentacles here, right? So, they could be feeling like maybe this connection takes a lot of work. Um... And even though I'm still unclear how things are going to pan out between the two of us, but I'm willing to go, I'm willing to work on it, I'm willing to see how it pans out, but not just waiting and see, but it feels like they are determined, okay, determined to put in work into this connection, one step at a time, one small detail at a time. Getting to know you better. Maybe like creating something together with you. Because Eight of Pentacles could indicate creation because this person is creating this pentacle here. So they could be feeling like well, if both of you work together, that both of you will be able to create something beautiful, okay? Wheel of Fortune, again, here is a verse here to stay. They could be stuck right now, especially if this is a long-distance connection. They may be feeling like they need to work really hard, save some money, and then come and see you. Or have you go and see them, okay? That's just for some of you if you're in a long-distance relationship with this person. Alright, Earth Signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn, this is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. I'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel, check it out if you want to. And the second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs for different topics, different questions. But these readings are still new, so they're still relevant. Because as you guys know, I post your videos almost every single day. Hope to see you back here again tomorrow. Take care, Earth Signs. Bye.